Daniela the dinosaur loved performing. She was in every school play, and she sang in the school's choir. It was time for school musical auditions. The musical was called Dinomania. It was all about dancing. Although Daniela loved to perform, she was scared. She wasn't scared to act out a scene. She did that perfectly. It wasn't the singing. She did that pretty well too. It was the dancing. Daniela loved music and danced all the time. Every morning she woke dancing to the music from her alarm clock. She danced to the theme song from her favorite TV show. She even danced, she even danced while she sang to herself in the shower, but never danced in front of anyone. Daniela tried to sneak out before her dance audition. She was just too scared to dance in front of anyone. Mrs. Baxter, the theater teacher, called her name. She was next. Oh no, Daniela thought. Even though she was scared, Daniela went back on stage for her dance audition. She took a deep breath. The music started. It began with a tail. Swish, swish, swishing to the beat. Then her feet started tapping. Her knees gave a slight bounce. Her hips circled like they were hula hooping. Her arms shook as they went up and down. Up and down. Her hands to the left and to the right. Forward. Then back. The other students waiting to audition laughed. Daniela ran off the stage. The next day, word spread to the whole school about her odd dancing. Daniela was embarrassed. Now everyone knew about her funny dancing style. The cast list for Dinomania was posted. Daniela didn't go look. She knew she didn't get a part in the musical because of her funny dancing. Mrs. Baxter saw Daniela in the hallway and congratulated her. It turns out Daniela didn't get just any role. I got the lead role, Daniela said, shocked. After all, Dinomania was about a girl with quirky dance moves who enters a popular dance competition. Mrs. Baxter thought Daniela's dancing style was perfect for the musical. Performance night arrived. Daniela peeked out from behind the curtain. Oh, full house. She was terrified. Daniela couldn't dance in front of all those dinosaurs. It was bad enough that students laughed at her dancing. Now all the parents would too. Mrs. Baxter saw the scared look on Daniela's face. You will do great, Daniela. Perform like you do best. Dancing and all, just have fun, said Mrs. Baxter. Oh, how can I have fun when I have to dance in front of all of them? Daniela thought to herself as she peeked out again from behind the stage curtain. She loved to perform. So Daniela decided to listen to Mrs. Baxter and try her best, silly dancing and all. During the performance, Daniela acted, sang, and even Dinomania danced her heart out. And the musical finished with the whole cast doing Daniela's Dinomania dance. Swish, swishing to the beat. Then their feet 
started tapping. Their knees gave a slight bounce. Their hips circled like they were a little hooping. Their arms shook as they went up and down. Up and down. Their hands moved to the left and to the right. Forward, then back. Daniela came out for her bow and got a standing ovation. The audience loved her dancing. <laughs> After that, the kids at school wanted to learn the Dinomania dance, so she taught some of them at lunch. She even got to teach her dance during gym class, and at recess, she taught the dance where even a few teachers joined in the fun. Daniela's Dino Mania dance even ended up on DinoTube and became the most popular dancing dinosaur video on the internet. <laughs> Daniela was interviewed by reporters about her unique dancing. That led to guest performances on national talk shows. Daniela's Dino Mania dance was the most popular dance that year. Her favorite experience was getting invited to the White House. The president wanted to learn the Dinomania dance for his birthday. Daniela showed him how it all started with the tail. Swish, swish, swishing to the beat. Then their feet started tapping. Their knees gave a slight bounce. Their hips circled like they were hula-hooping. Their arms shook as they went up and down. Up and down. Their hips moved to the left and to the right. Forward, then backward. Daniela faced her fear. She was no longer afraid of her unique dancing style. Daniela now danced all the time. You could find her dancing at the school bus stop and at the grocery store to the overhead music. She even danced at the dentist's office when she got a no cavity report. Daniela was born to stand out in a most Dinomania kind of way. <laughs> <laughs>